Hi fam, how are you people doing today? Good morning. So you're welcome to my channel again. My name is Obiano G. Chris. If you're a new subscriber, thank you for stopping by. You're welcome. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you too. God bless you. Thank you for always watching. Guys, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe this video at the end of it all. So one thing I notice again in this in my videos are most of you people watch, but you never tend to comment. What did I do now? Please, people should always try to comment, okay? Let me know that you've watched my video. Don't just watch and leave. I need to know that, oh, so the so person is watching this video, okay? So guys, how is this quarantine thing going now? Man, in this area that we are everywhere is dead. Like you can barely find anybody outside. I don't know the I don't in fact I don't I don't know the year that this thing is going to end, but I hope and pray that sooner or later this one too shall pass away. How is it in your own um location? I heard in Nigeria they extended the lockdown to two weeks. Well I understand that it's very demoralizing and um, there is hunger and famine in the country. No, not famine anyways, but there is hunger in the country. A lot of people are not able to feed their families and all. But I just feel that let's just be safe for once. But then it keeps me thinking like, uh -uh, what about all the 50 million and the rest of them that they said that um, they gave the government to support citizens? You know, I was just thinking, I said, ah, if I had power, maybe what I would have done is... If I have my own money and I know that I can help the world, I probably just do a transfer to everybody's accounts. At least, eh? Let's just let people have money to eat. Let them not just send people home. Don't just tell them to stay indoors. There is no light. There is no water. There is no food. I mean, it's very terrible. The other day, I saw a taxi driver who had to pull off his trousers because he. He was against what government is doing and he was really crying that hunger is even worse than the pandemic itself. I just pray that this will come to an end very soon and God will help us. Anyways, from the title of this video, you already know what I'm going to talk about. So I'm going to be showing you guys what I eat in a day. This video is in collaboration with another YouTuber. Yes, this is my first collaboration with a wonderful YouTuber. Her name is Vivian's Diary. I'm going to put her YouTube name. If you hear anything, please ignore. Maybe Sky is in the background. I don't know if you can see him there. Anyways, so this video is in collaboration with um, Vivian's Diary. I'm going to put her name um, on the screen. So you guys go check her out. Tell her that you're coming from me. You know, leave a comment on her channel. She's a food and lifestyle blogger vlogger rather she's a food and lifestyle youtuber so and um, vivian does the most most complex meals in the easiest way that would not consume your data that is one thing i know about her so she does the complex meals in the easiest and shortest form and if you want to learn i think her channel is the best place to because she's very detailed but she does it in such a way that you will not waste data for those of us that used to cry about wasting so much data when we are watching youtube videos so that's the sole focus of her channel so guys check her out tell her that you're coming from me please don't also forget to like her videos subscribe you know and all those good stuff anyway so let me just go on now to show you guys what i eat in a day As you guys know, in my previous, in my last vlog, I talked about my weight and how, you know, I've been having back pain and also codedly, codedly, we should not tell anyone, <laughs> codedly, codedly, I decided to start watching my weight. Yes, this guy just clocked um, four months, a couple of days ago, but a girl has to do what she has to do now. Eh? Let me not go and begin to look like my husband's mama so i had to codectly you know start watching my weight i'm not really strict on the diet but i'm doing it so i've been doing intermittent fasting and i've also been doing portion control 
Although sometimes as a human that I am, I would also indulge in things like chocolate eggs. So during the Easter period, I ate a lot of Easter eggs. Whatever, I don't care. I'm not in the haste anyways to lose the weight. My only concern is just the fact that my back and my waist aches. So I've been doing the weight loss thing codedly, codedly, and I can tell you to an extent that I've been feeling a little bit better because I've been doing the intermittent fasting and the portion control. Yes. So guys, if you don't know what intermittent fasting is, it's a, a period whereby you have to fast and eat. So there are different types of intermittent fasting. Hold on, I'm coming. The one I'm doing is the 16-8. You fast for 16 hours with an 8-hour feeding window. That's the one I'm doing. But you have other ones like the circadian rhythm. So the fast starts by sunset and lasts till the morning. Then you have the 18-6. That 18-6, you fast for 18 hours and feed for 6 hours. Then you have the 20, 24. So you fast for 20 hours and you feed for in 4 hours. Then you have the 36 hours fast. So it's also known as the monk fast. You have to fast for 36 hours without eating anything. I think the only thing you can take is water. So um, you also have the custom fast where you have to create your own fast. You have to fast for like seven days straight and then you you eat after the seven days or whatever. I'm not interested in that one, so I really don't know. So the app I've been using to track this my fast is called the zero app and because i know that i don't have anybody i'm accountable to sometimes i tend to indulge a lot so i decided to download this fast and i started using it that way i can always be accountable to this app and you know record when i eat and and um, when i fast so the last time i ate was about 6 pm yesterday and right now it's about um, five minutes past twelve, and I've not had anything apart from um, a bottle of water. So that's what I've been doing. I'm going to eat. I'm going to eat within now till like six p.m. and then start my fast again till the next day. It's about about this time. So I do um, the fast. I do. I eat only two times in a day so that's what I've been doing I've been trying to eat only two times in a day and I'm also trying to you know control my portions yes so guys please please do this again <laughs> my chairman is at the back there oh his pacifier has fallen so that's why I think he's trying to let me know that his pacifier has fallen so anyways I'm showing you people what i'm going to be eating for today okay guys so um for my today's menu the first thing i'm going to take is celery juice so i'm going to be doing some juice with this celery i got this from cooperative yeah so if you're in the uk you can get it from Co cooperative you can get it from um tesco you can get it from aldi whatever any store you can get it from there um you can also get it from all those pakistos yes so and if you're in nigeria and you're wondering where you can get celery i think you can get it from all those abokis for some people they like to eat it with uh, peanut butter but i've never tried it before i've already taken it in juice and guys notice how eh? notice how celery is very it's a very good spice so if you want to make fish for barbecue you know chicken chicken whatever chicken barbecue fish barbecue barbecue in general celery is a very good spice for it so if i want to try it and let me know in the comment section so i'm just going to have about five sticks that's what i'm going to be using for my celery juice and after the juice i'm going to stay for about one hour before putting any other thing in my mouth
a smoothie maker. So I'm just going to put it into here, put some water, blend it, sieve it, and then drink. And then if you feel that you might not be able to drink it, you might not be able to drink the juice. So what you can do is you can add um, ginger and lemon. But for me, the, time, the first time I did it and I added lemon, I didn't like the taste. Because I tasted it before and after I added the lemon, I didn't like the taste. So I would rather just have it with ginger alone. Right now, I think the time is about, let me see, okay, 25 minutes past 12, that's the time, so, just going to have it, come drink with me, <laughs> So that's why I'm just having five sticks. I could have as well just taken everything, but you know, I'm just having five sticks, and um, like I said, I'm not in my haste, and I don't want to endanger my baby as well. So the next time I'm going to eat is going to be in about one hour. That's going to be like past one. Yeah, you should that's the time I eat. She see that boy because his fire has fallen. I will not hear a word now. <laughs> Say hi. Say hi. Give me Say hi. <laughs> Addiction. <laughs> My subscribers are always asking of you, anyways. They always say I should greet you, so you have to greet them back today. So that's why I have to say bye. Tell them to like, share, subscribe, comment, and mommy's video. Alright, okay, guys, so I just want to dust the house and let's see. Just basically keep it tidy. I really don't have much I'm doing.
So that was a form of exercise. So guys, anyways, if you're not following me on um, Instagram, I think you should do so, okay? So you can always use the name of Yanu Chris to check me out on Instagram. There I post a lot of pictures. Um, my husband takes my pictures for me and I post them. <laughs> but I've not been able to post this couple of days because the recent ones that we took, man, I was looking like a balloon. <laughs> oh my god, my happy child. My happy, 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 happy child. So I'm sure that most of you have seen my husband. Who does this baby look like? Me or my husband? Everybody says he looks like my husband. They say like I cannot carry this boy for nine months. And he will look like his father. Like he will must look like me. So he looks like me obviously. Right? Okay guys, so right now it's about 1.30 as you can see from the back. I'm so famished, like <laughs> I can't eat a human being. Do you think I'm talking to you? So I'm busy laughing. I can eat a human being right now and I'm even so confused on what to eat. Like I'm craving for everything. I'm craving for meat, I'm craving for eggs, I'm craving for fish, I'm craving for bread. What do I do now? Anyways, I brought out a couple of things that I want to eat and I'm just going to have all of them in a little little portion. Don't believe me. So guys, let's just dive into um, making lunch and I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to be eating. Anyways, guys, this is the current situation. This hotel does not want to sleep on this one. So I had to back in so that I'm able to eat. Yeah, I'm going to have some bacon. So this one came in large quantity, I had to portion them and put them in the ziplock bag. Then I have whole wheat bread and I have some eggs. Yes, I have mackerel. Don't preach to me, I don't want to hear. I'm just going to put two pieces of the ham and I think two slices of bread in the oven. are clean in box for the receive and sit in all the time. I don't know, I'm using this brand shop. I like my food hot and spicy. My husband calls me wine in Yoruba. Seasoning cubes, some salt, black pepper. This is my breakfast. I am not be eating a big slice of bread because I just forgot about that. It will be too much. And I'm going to eat.
<sighs> okay guys so um done eating and the time now is 15 minutes past three ah, did i say past three 15 minutes past two okay i'm just basically going go on i'll just go on now to clean the kitchen and then come back to relax press my phone very 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 good any get anyways guys please eh, while you're watching don't forget to give this video a thumbs up like subscribe share and all that good stuff and also forget to go check out um vivian's diary and see what she's up to i promise that you know regret it okay <sighs> i'm tired um it's about 7 p.m. now, five minutes past seven actually. And I'm about to have my second meal for the day. Initially, I said I was not going to eat anything serious. I was just going to have salad and the chicken. So in the morning, when I was trying to bring out what I was going to eat this evening, I saw one um, plate of bono soup that I, I made. And that was bono soup. Oh my God, he went to Harvard. So my husband, my husband started eating and I was just drooling. I was having long throat. I said I must eat this abono soup today. It's been like two weeks since I had swallowed last. So I'm just going to eat abono soup and wheat swallow. I'll show you guys what the process is like. Okay, so guys, this is my abono soup. It has a lot of pomo, shaki, oboroko, dry fish. Just name it beef i'm going to put it now in the microwave and then i have my hot water already boiling that i'm going to use in fact there's no point i'm going to be having just a soup i changed my mind i don't think i'm having any swallow because the pomo inside will probably get me filled yes guys realistically that is how i've been eating for the past two weeks now yeah so just going to warm up the soup in the microwave and that's what I'm going to be having for dinner until tomorrow. Okay, so I'm just going to show you what the finished product is like, and that's it. So nothing really about what I eat in the day. That's what I've been eating. So guys, let's not forget to give this video a thumbs up at the end of it. Give it a thumbs up, like, comment, share, and please don't forget go to Vivian's channel. Go and see what she's up to today. Please, I'm begging. Okay, guys. So my baby is crying. Let me just end this video. So this is what my bono soup looks like, and this is what I'm going to be having for dinner. Yes, I'm that weird. Taking only your bonus soup for dinner. Anyways, guys, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up, like I said. Until next time, bye.